Oh, come on. We've had so many. Oh, there we go. That's going to be it. Flip them up. Yes, yes, yes. We did it. Uh, no, 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 no. You can't be. How is that possible? What is up, everyone? Welcome back to the channel. We're back at it with more Grand Theft Auto 5 LSPDFR gameplay. And check out this amazing old school cruiser I am taking out today. You can't get any more old school than this. I mean, just look at the light bar on that thing. It's huge, right? But it looks awesome. I love this car. It's part of the 1995 to class premier emergency pack over on GTA 5 mods.com. It's done by Beastie Bill 88. What a sharp looking car. I absolutely love it. I love the old school stuff. So this is going to be our car for today. I actually think it's kind of based on maybe a Chevy Caprice or something like that. I could be wrong. Not 100% sure, but I think so. Anyway, like I said, we're back in uh, Los Santos, of course, with the LSPD. We're going to be cruising over here in Vespucci Beach and the canal area seeing what kind of stuff we can get into and what kind of baddies we can find anyway let's go ahead and get on patrol guys let's, we'll get started here all right we're just out cruising around seeing what we can get into and we've got a pursuit going already let's uh, get all the things going let's hit that and he's going through the alley i just knew i was going to head him off down here but he's going through the alley now so and now he's on the beach nice that's going to be bad because there's lots of people out and about on the beach um i'm kind of wondering if we can head this guy off this is going to be bad this almost reminds me of the blues brothers like the mall scene or whatever oh okay let's see i don't think we're going to be able to catch up with him going this way i should have gone i should have stayed on the street like if i had thought about it yeah y'all need to go get out the way and it looks like they're totally going on the actual beach, right? Yeah, they are. They're coming back this way. Okay. This would not be legit at all. I don't see these cruisers being able to handle the uh, the sand, but we'll try it. We'll see here. And we're going to need to get some backup, too. All right. I don't know what initiated this pursuit, but we're going to try. Yeah, I think we need some backup. Need some backup for sure. Let's do that. Let's just stay on the road here. All right, we've got some backup on the way. Where is he going? These people, y'all need to clear the sidewalk. Come on, get out of the way. Oh, uh, we've got a bunch of cruisers down there on top of them. Maybe they'll nab them. Nope, they did not. They let us down once again. Feel like the Emperor in Star Wars. You failed me. <laughs> you failed me again. All right, let's see. Get on down here. Oh, this is so dicey. At least it's late in the evening. Usually it's really crowded out here. All right, let's see if we can block this guy off right here. Nope, you're not. Oh, that was really bad. Yo, she's going to get right over. Get out of the way. Go. All right. Uh, yeah, let's keep, let's keep at it. Oh, but why did you wreck into the tree, dude? Y'all are so bad. You know what? We need an air unit. I wasn't going to get an air unit, but I really kind of think we need an air unit now. Like, All right. They're still going this way. I think we're going to try to go down a little bit and head them off. Let's see if we can do it. Let's head them off at the pass. Yeah, he's still going. Yeah. Still going. We're going to need even more pursuit. We need that air unit. Pronto al dente. We need the air unit. Come on. All right, let's see what he does here. He's at the intersection. Looks like he's in the parking lot. I don't think he's going to have a good way to get out of there other than going back the other direction. Maybe? No, he is. He's still going back this way. Never mind. All right, let's turn one more time. All right, at least the air unit's on him, so that's good. We've got that going for us. And he's right here. No, 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 no. Nope. All right, well, we forced him back the other way towards the other units here. Come on, y'all pit him. Do something. Make yourselves useful because these guys are so bad. Come on, y'all get out of the way. <laughs> Their cars are beat to hell. And they haven't done anything. Like, all they do, all they do is succeed in, like, trashing their cars. But they don't ever do anything useful. All right, let's keep... Keep going. Oof, a little bit loose on the rear end there. Oh, I love this car. This car screams West Coast Police Department to me. Like, you can't get any more West Coast PD than a black and white with the red and blue lights and stuff like that. Like, what is going on with this dude? Why are you out? You can't get any more West Coast PD than this, right? Where is he going now? Like, he is doing some crazy stuff. All right, is he 
going to yeah he's just like going through parking lots and alleyways and oh come on we've had so many oh there we go that's gonna be it flip them up yes 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 we did it uh, no 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 you can't be how is that possible how is that possible this dude can do that like we flipped his car and then he just went back on his wheels and oh man this is dangerous like he's going through all kinds of public uh oh there we go here we go here there we go now we got him you know what? we had to take one for the team ah no stop dude Oh, come on. We need some backup. All right, let's get our taser. I didn't have a taser out. Oh, you guys are so bad. We need some more backup. Let's see if we can catch up with them. I, I don't want to pull my radio up because then we'll fall behind even further. And, like, we're the closest to this guy. Ah, no, taser, taser, taser. Yes, got him. Yes, get on the ground. Stay down. Uh-uh, stay down, dude. You need to stay down. Uh-uh, hands up. There you go. There you go, down the ground. Police, hands up now! <laughs> you done messed up, buddy. Seriously, that was bad. Man, that was a crazy pursuit right out the gate. I love it though, I like getting uh, action packed. Like as soon as we get in, it's just something good. That was a good pursuit, I enjoyed that. That was a lot of fun. All right, listen, who is this dude? Let's pat him down real fast. Let's see, uh, pat down the pen by myself. Man, narcotic intoxication, no surprise there. Look at the cruisers, <laughs> they're beat up so bad. Oh, uh, we got a hit and run, you know what? No one has time for that, so I'm sorry. Uh, Creek Ufan, Creek Ufan's gonna be this guy. He has got a napkin with a woman's name and number. I hear you, Creek. A uh, Walkman cassette player and $1,000 in cash. All right, money, okay, let's, um, Oh, I don't even know what to do. You know what? I, I don't think we're going to charge this guy or go through any of that because we don't know what initiated the pursuit. Like, we don't have all the details. Uh, so we made the arrest, but I think what we're going to do is just call him a, uh, a transport and let them take care of the charges and all that stuff. Basically, we're going to dump them off on someone else. Yeah, it never tells you what the pursuit's about or... It, what was that about? She just fell out on the floor. <laughs> she fell out on the ground. Are you okay? <laughs> what, what's wrong with you? Oh, uh, I don't even know where our cruiser's at. Let's look at this damage over here. Are they trying to put him in a regular car? Are they really gonna do that? Come on, I know they're not. Man, this cruiser is beat up bad. Both of them are, look at that. No windshields, no bumpers, <laughs> they're so bad. Oh, these guys are so bad. Where did we hit him at? I think it's back there. Yeah, I see my light. Look at my lights back there. Don't that look good? Listen, I don't need a posse to go with me, okay? You guys can go on about your business now. We're good. How are you? We're good here, y'all go on. Don't need you anymore. I know I'm the bomb because I stopped the uh, pursuit, but y'all can go about your business now. What's going on, my dude? Not much, my dude. He was like, what's going on, my dude? <laughs> Not much. Uh, we were way more active in this pursuit than anyone else, and our car isn't nearly as beat up as theirs. I mean, it's a little scratched up. A little beat up there, but not too bad. Let's go ahead and search his car and see what he's got. And we have a partner. I don't need a partner. Please go. Please go, dude. I don't need you and your Ray-Bans and all that stuff. Just go somewhere else, all right? There you go. Spur works alone. Spur's working alone today. I don't need no partner. All right. Let's see. What can we do? Is search the vehicle real fast. See what he's got going on here. Toolbox with hammer, screwdriver, crowbar, lockpick, master keys, and a mini torch. Uh, he's got an application to San Andreas Highway Patrol and a wrapped Christmas gift. With 31 ounce baggies of white powder. Oh no, yeah. <laughs> God, this is a gift that keeps giving, right? <laughs> oh, okay. Well, that's why, uh, that's why he's going to jail. Okay, we took it. We're gonna let them do all the other stuff. Like I said, I'm not gonna get involved with this. So let's get a tow. And we'll get a rollback for him. And we'll go 10-8 here in just a second as soon as they get that uh, get that towed. Man, that's a good looking car. I love those old school light bars. Like I was saying earlier, like this screams West Coast. I grew up in the South, right? So 
all the police departments I remember as a kid in the South, like they were always all blue lights. The highway patrol units, uh, the local police, like everyone was all blue lights. I don't remember any police departments or anyone in the area that I grew up that did red and blue. Like that's always been kind of like a West Coast thing to me, so. All right, let's kill that and let's kill these lights right here. Oops, nope, not that. Okay, there we go. We'll see if the tow truck can actually get out of here. How many times is he going to hit the light post before he actually successfully exits the parking lot? All right, let's go to fix vehicle. There we go. All right, I want to look at some court cases real fast because we had someone we threw the book at last time, and I think it was Furio, right? Wasn't it Furio in the last episode? Oh, yeah, he had driving the wrong way, evading arrest, uh, leaving the scene of an accident, reckless driving, speeding 100 plus, grand theft, possession of drug paraphernalia, and then on the other one, we got him for a warrant. Yeah, he had a warrant out. Okay, yeah, this was a dude and the girl that we got in that really long high-speed pursuit with in the last episode. So let's see what happened to Furio. Let's go ahead and see what he got. Uh, Furio only got five years and seven months for all of that. Are you kidding me? Driving the wrong way, he got probation. Uh, for evading arrest, he got his license suspended for 13 months and granted probation. For the leaving the scene of an accident, he got his license suspended for nine months and granted probation. Reckless driving, he got his license suspended for 11 months and seven months in prison. Speeding 100 plus, he got his license suspended for 10 months and granted probation. Grand theft, he got five years in prison. And possession of drug paraphernalia, he got uh, granted probation on that. So he's got uh, $17,564 in fines and five years, seven months in prison. We, the girl we arrested for prostitution got like 18 years or something, didn't she? I can't remember. She got a really super long time, but she did assault an officer, so that could be the difference. But, man, I was really just certain this dude was going to be put away for a really long time. He did. He must have had an excellent lawyer. All right, let's see the warrant for his arrest. Uh, yeah, he got four years for that, too. So he got a total of nine years. I thought this dude was going to go away for like 20 years. I really just did. And the tow truck is still hitting the telephone pole. <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Let's get back at it. Let's go 10-8. Do all the things. Code 4 10 8. All right, we just got to call out for some suspicious ATM activity right up the street. So we're going to hit our lights. We're not going to respond with our side. It says code three, but I'm like, you know what? I don't want to let them know that we're coming. And so they'll be ready or they can run. I like being sneaky. So we're just going to slip up here and see if we can catch them in the act. There he is. Yeah, you need to stop, dude. Nope. Uh, we got okay good we've got uh we got back up to oh what How, what happened no dude you oh he's got a crowbar and they are just, <laughs> down the ground uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. i thought i had a gun i thought i had a taser 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 Y'all stop. I got him. He's good. I got him. I got him. I got him. I got him. He's okay. I got him. Drop the, drop the crowbar. There you go. Down the ground. Down the ground, dude. Down now. That just kind of came out of nowhere. I didn't, I like, I just roll up and the next thing I know he's being shot. All right. Let's get his hands behind his back. Get him in custody. There we go. Man, that, things are popping off today. I'm telling you, things really just are. All right, let's move him over here on the sidewalk, kind of clean up the scene just a little bit. So we were called for suspicious ATM activity, but like, what was he doing? You know, uh, of course he ran. And then he, no, I don't need to do the back door. I always do that, never fails. Door, me and doors just have the worst luck. Like, I don't know what it is. All right, let's, uh, Back up over here. I think it's be good right here. I get up on the sidewalk a little bit, clear the street so traffic can go. Nice. All right, he should be able to go about his business now. And I think my backup just took off and left us. Let's get one more unit just in case. Backup needed in the Spooky Canal. All right, partner, what's going on, dude? Like, I don't think he needs EMS because he seems to be okay. I mean, he does, but. Uh, 
All right, listen, I need to pat you down real fast. Pat him down, see what's going on with him here. Uh, he's got a comb, a receipt from an up and at him, and a bottle of codeine. Uh, his name's Alex Williams. Okay, we'll go run him real fast. Let our partner know here, or let our backup know what's going on. Hey, yeah, we rolled up on the ATM. This point. dude bolted on me as soon as I pulled up. Uh, we had a quick chase. Uh, had a backup unit show up. Dude pulled out a crowbar. Uh, they fired off several rounds at him. They might have grazed him a little bit, but he seems to be okay. And uh, I've just taken him into custody, so... Let me, uh, let me run him through the system, see what's going on with him. He had codeine, but I'm going to say that's his. We're going to say the codeine is for him. He's got the, uh, he's got a prescription. Uh, ped records. Alex Williams. What's Alex Williams got going on? Nothing. No warrants, no probation, no gun permits. He's got a citation for shoplifting, hunting out of season, and neon underglow. There's lots of people get that here at Los Santos. We're all time giving that ticket out. Yeah, he's pretty uh, he's pretty clean on that stuff. So I think what we're going to do, um, actually, let's go back and charge him. Let's get um, resisting arrest with violence. We could definitely get him for that because he had the crowbar. He came after us when we got out of the car. Oh, he was being shot multiple times. So we could get him for that. Um, as far as like what he was doing at the ATM, we don't know. Like, it looks like he was just hanging out around it. So. I think that's it. I, I think that's it. You guys that watch this, y'all can always leave a comment below and, and like add on charges if you know, if you know more charges that we can put on because that's the only way I'm going to learn. So let me know down in the comments, I said, uh, for charges that we could add on. All right. All right, we're cruising down Magellan Avenue. We got at least one subject out here drinking on the sidewalk, so we definitely can't have that. That is a no-no in Los Santos, so we're going to swing around. And have them pour it out. I don't want to hassle them too much about it. Just have them pour it, you know, pour it out and go on about their business. I think they will. the other guy looks okay. Yeah, he's just. Uh, oh no, he's not okay. What is that? Yeah, I think that is a bottle. Yeah. Listen, partner. No, man, you you got to pour that out, dude. You can't you can't have that out here. All right. Yeah, you gotta pour that. You gotta pour that out, dude. Listen, I'm not here to hassle you or anything like that. You just need to pour it out and get on about your business, okay? All right, off you go. There you go. Shit. All right. All right. Have a good evening. All right, you too, man. Y'all just go ahead and move on, okay? Just go ahead and move. Need y'all to move on. Y'all can't. Uh, y'all can't be drinking on the sidewalk there. All right, nice. That was simple. All right, let's go ahead and go back to Nate. Yeah, we have a lot of that here in Los Santos. You know, I mean, you see it all the time. So if we took everyone to jail that we saw out drinking in public, we <laughs> that's all we would be doing. We wouldn't be doing anything else. All right, let's go ahead and jump on this one. It's going to be fighting in Little Soul. It's not too terribly far away for that either, so. No other details other than there's some kind of fight going on, so we'll see. Of course, this is also another non-ELS car. Uh, I prefer ELS myself, but, you know, it's all right. We make it work. Love the old school stuff. I am wanting to find an old school, uh, I need an old school uh, police bike. I want to do some uh, biker patrols, some bike patrols. And uh, I want something like they had in Chips. I think Chips had the Kawasaki's. They're riding Kawasaki's. Who remembers Chips? I know some of you do. I know you guys vibe with me, so some of you have to uh, remember Chips, right? Like, I know you do. Officer Poncharello was the bomb. I used to watch that show like crazy when I was a kid. Loved it. You remember, they always had the little lead-in scene. They'd had the lead-in scene. Something bad would happen, right? Like this crazy big pile-up or, oh, here's the fight right here. Man, they're beating the hell out of each other. <laughs> they really are. No, 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 no. Y'all, uh, you need to stop it. Oh, man. I am having a hard time with these lights today. I'm telling you. All right, let's get a taser out. Ah, uh, down on the ground. Nope. Oh, shoot. Too far. Y'all stop. Uh, I think I'm going to get the other guy. Yeah, let's go after the other dude first. Let's get him. 
Come on, you need to stop, dude. You're gonna get tased. You're gonna get tased. You need to stop running. All right, taser deployed. Uh, the cop's sitting right there and he's not even watching. Ah, uh, stop! Down on the ground, uh-uh, down, LSPD, now. Freeze. Down, down on the ground, dude, down. All right, let's go ahead and take him in custody. There we go, now we got, anyway, back to chips while we walk this dude back to the car. All right, who remembers, like, they always had the lead-in scene, right? Like, usually it was some kind of super bad, crazy pileup, right? Some kind of car crash or something going on, right? And then, once they got responding to the emergency, then that, that beat would drop. You know that? <laughs> oh, it was so good. It was such a good show. I loved it. All right, let's see. He's got a Glock 45, a wad of $1 bills, a wallet with two white tablets, a bandana. His name's Mark Wright. Okay. Let's walk him back to the car. We'll walk him back to the cruiser. I The other dude's probably long gone, unfortunately, but... Uh, this dude was getting the best of them, so I don't know. It's kind of a tough one. We didn't have backup to like get everyone taken care of. All right, here we go. Yeah, it's always raining, right? Like every time I play this game, it never fails. It rains. I mean, I know I could change it, but I kind of like going with it. I don't like manipulating the weather if I don't have to. So. All right, let's get some backup here. Code two. There we go. All right, Mark, tell me what's going on, dude. What happened with uh, you and your buddy back there? Why y'all fighting? Do you know him? Yeah, you do. Y'all are friends? Okay. All right, well, hang tight. I got to run your information real fast. Actually, you know what? Let's have him deal down. Dude's already bolted on us once. I've never had him bolt like in cuffs. I can't remember, so. All right, down the ground right here, dude. Let's hop in. Let's run his information. See what he looks like. Uh, Ped records. Mark Wright. He's got an expired driver's license. Yeah, he's not driving. I can't get him for that. No warrants. He does have a gun permit. He did have the gun on him, so that's fine. Um, nothing else. So, yeah, I think we're going to have to charge him. I think we're going to charge him on this. If they hadn't run, I guess we could have just cited him. But uh, we're going to charge him. All right, I think um, since this was a fist fight, from what I understand, I think we're going to get him for simple battery because the dude got up and left on his own. He wasn't really injured. It wasn't permanent injuries or anything like that. So, yeah. And then I'm going to say that he made threats as well to uh, leading up to the fight. So, we're going to get him for simple assault too. So, not that big of a deal really to me, but I think that's what we're going to go with. So... Let's back out of that. Let's open the action menu. Let's submit the charges. And we'll get someone to uh, transport Mark. You know, actually, I think we may just take a Mark. Oh, there's backup here already. Never mind. You know what? Never mind. Never mind. In fact, uh, let's go ahead and get in our rain jacket, too. Plus PD patrol. Raincoat. There we go. All right, that's better. Now we can be dry. All right, Mark, you're going to jail, dude. Hop up. Let's get you up, and you can go with this lady right here. You know the routine. Can transport. There we go. Nice. All right, so if you'll take him in for me, just got him for simple assault and battery, so nothing too big. All right, let's hop back in and we'll go code 1408. One more time, uno mas. All right, guys, that's gonna do it for this one. I hope y'all enjoyed. If you did, please be sure to hit that like, subscribe, ring that bell, leave me a comment. Let me know what you think of the old school light bar and the old school cruisers. I love them. Love all you guys as well. Thank you so much for your support. We're coming up on 5,000 subs, so I really do appreciate each and every one of you and everything you've done to support the channel, so. We'll catch you on the streets of Los Santos next time. Peace.